to the fly. Mermaid spoke from a waterfall and cried, This tongue's too small for me. Merlin closed his eyes and with a sigh, That mermaid was in the sea. I got so excited I clung even tighter and soon I was hugging my tree. I giggled inside, a prayer I cried, Please, magic man, don't see me. And what can I do for you, Vixie, hiding behind the tree? Giggling heartbeat of laughter, who thought I couldn't see? I'm sorry to spy on you, Merlin. I hope you do not mind. I was watching you with the others. You are very kind. I hope you remember this, Vixie. I'm never going to mind. You're here as much as we are. It's a nice day, don't you find? Yes, sir. Today is quite lovely. And that's a pretty waterfall, too. And so many wonderful animals. Better than in the zoo. Well, come on over here, Vixie, and sit and chat a while. My friends have been wanting to meet you. I couldn't help but smile. Did you know I was going to be here? How do you do the things you do? I've only just found my way here. I'm going to be late for school. Nonsense, you little silly. I've got the clock all turned. And while I've got you with me, there's some magic to be learned. I walked to the crowd of creatures, politely sat down on a rock. An elfling climbed up in my lap. Quietly, I thought, how do they make them so cute, so little and so sweet? I bet it's a special magic when their mamas and papas meet. You're right again, dear Vixie, when true love's in the air, magic starts manifesting, painting faces, bodies, and hair. I wonder if true love will meet me. I wonder if he's a prince. I wonder if he'll think I'm pretty and ask me in the dance. Come with me, little sister. You deserve to see it all. I tried in time to see Merlin walk through the waterfall. I walked as fast as I could, afraid that I couldn't get in. I thought it might close upon me, and then I'd have to swim. But I made it inside, and this there in a cave was a library filled with books. An altar of stone, two chairs, a bed, and a bathrobe on the hook. Come on in and sit. There's a chair for you and me. Would you like some food? Would you like some tea? I have some bread and cheese, but I admit the bread is old. Oh, why are you sniffling, Vicky? Do you have a cold? No, no, Mr. Merlin. I really don't know why, but thinking of ever leaving makes me want to cry. I know I can't stay forever, but I never want to go. You're oh so full of wisdom that I dearly want to know. Well, Vicky, I'd love to have you. This is your family. And your I know how much they love you. I know. I'm a big dog lover. But don't forget, we're here now. We have